Hello guys, in this video I will just show you uh, the one thing that I use to figure shit out in this game other than uh, you know other YouTube videos I'm just a little small guy doing just random shit but I would just like to show you this website per with GG so I use this you should use this website if you want to pull for a character or let's say that's how i use it right so you pick your crew you have your team i have my dps my support now i would definitely need a healer right so we go here we go tier list and then we see in what patch everything is good I usually don't want to bother with global or CN. I just go here overall and then we take a look. So if I look at it, I have a Centurion on S, which is really good. I have a Lilia on A. That's also very good. For support, I have a Sonetto leveled up, as you can see, and currently in the process of leveling Bakern, or I still can't pronounce the name. Now, before I knew about this website, I was just leveling up random shit, right? But then, let's just skip that. But then I realized that I have a lot of units on this list. You may have them as well. You just don't know if they're good, you know? You're just using your main squad. You're leveling up random stuff that you think is a good one. Or maybe it is in your mind, but you know, overall, I'm selling. So this is a very good side where you can see the overall overall tier list. It is, it does change, but I think a few, of, a lot of these characters are gonna be here on S for a lot for a long while. Now this might help you in a way where you want to summon stuff. Okay, so for example, my DPS is set okay i have a beast dps i also have a star dps i and i have a healer with um with plant right she's not that of a healer i think she's uh, more of a um more of a dps if i'm not mistaken now for example right you have, just have this question what is she you know is she a healer you go to this website. See, you go Druvis, and then you can see right here what she does. And here you have a well of information. For example, you have skills. If we go to skills, you can see what the passive is, uh, what the silence of the woods is. You go wind into the woods. You can see at each star rating what they do so for example here you might not want to do a one star you might want to wait so it gets a debuff and then it will do a petrify one run now petrify is really useful you know so doing this you can just look and kind of judge the character how it is now before even pulling for the character you can see what the inside one two three looks like if you actually do want to invest into this character, how much is the bonus that she is getting with each inside? Or if you have, if you want to pull for more than one, what bonuses happen at each portrait? These are a lot of uh, these um, information is known just by clicking on the character, but I always want to go here. Then you see the most compatible psychos. You know, these you can you can get for free i mean with the um, with the currency you know, here if you wait for a long while you're like oh i want to level up my druvis right you go on the website you can only buy one psi cube you know these this resource is a rare one see so like oh, okay so i need to look at one of these and then you look at each individual psi cubes you know See so here information stats at level 60. How, how much 
bonuses it gets. Don't mind my RuneScape. Uh, how many bonuses it gets, you get an impression, you know. It's really, really good. And then, for example, right, where then we go back to the pools situation. I go back, I already have a beast S tier. I also have that, okay? So, I don't need Melania. I don't need Balloon Party. I could get uh, duplicates, but at the moment I don't really need it. And I'm not really interested in Sweetheart as well. So this banner falls through for me right away. Now we have here Regulars. Regulars is a way, is a better DPS, a star DPS than my Lilia. However, I do already have a six star star DPS. So in my opinion, it's kind of not pointless, but not that good of an investment as a free-to-play player to have multiples of one, right? I'd much rather wait for new banners than pull forever. Also, I have Dyke and Satsuki as well. I have multiple Dykes and Satsuki, I think. I mean, DK. Yeah, I have two and Satsuki. I have three. Right? One and I was born holding this coin, but I have no idea where So, it came from. with this you can see what you want to pull for, if you want to skip a banner, if you really want to go in the banner. Then, the thing that I use this the most is this. The inside material cheat sheet and the Psycubes cheat sheet. The ma inside material cheat sheet is basically what you want to farm in a certain stage. For example, I go back here, I go crew, I want to go oh. my Centurion, because I really want to invest in, in her as much as possible. For Resonant, Resonant 8, I need four of these, right? Let's go craft into the wilderness. Let's see what we need. We need these. And these give skulls and silver you need to craft. Now we can go here, purple tier materials. You need bones, like we said, and silver. Bones and silver. So I would more or less want to farm this. Because it gives silver, like you can look at that, right? Bones and silver. I would want to do this for bones. 420. You need bones, you take that. You need, for example, silver. I would go with the, this one, since you get one and a half silver ore and you have, you get a 5.16% chance of a rough iron ore ingot, which also helps with this, right? Rough iron ore ingot. So this is how you can, you, you just, like, it, it does help, like, you can go here. Now, this is common, possible. This is not 100%, right? Some people just go, oh, it's a common item. You know, you can scroll down a little bit see that this is made out of these now there's fixed rates here here and common as well we go here see there's a 65 percent chance of shattered bones on 220 let's see what's on 28 you can search 28 as well Da, 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 da. Now you see, there's not that much da, 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 da. shattered bones. Three eight, three eight. Oh, you see, now this is something I've learned as well. So a fixed is not always better. You see, I'm learning things as well. So doing other things is worth it more. So. This is a very good well of information of what you can do. I'm not the best of players. I'm, I don't want to 
appear to be so. I'm just kind of want to give you information that I found, and then you can do it however you want. So you know, um, you can judge me for that, but you know, I'm just showing you guys. Also, side cubes. A lot of side uh, cube suggestions for each one, so we know how to what to put on each one of them. Also, really helps. Now if we go home, we can also see the new content, like patch 1.5 reveal for CN, I think. There's also, if you want to pull from Melania, if you're going to go read that, it gives you a lot of good information, gives you some pros, cons for it. You can see how it's going to look, portrays, synergies with the other team. Now, this is a very good well of information. Also have active codes, you know. See, and upcoming banners as well. So in 16 hours and 5 minutes, there's going to be a banner for pickles. Now, I don't know if this is a CN or hours, but since they have a current event timeline of things expiring, I think this would always, this would be um, a good thing. So, for example, I can just look there. So in 14 days, Tooth Fairy comes out. So Tooth Fairy, I think, is a... Uh, a healer yeah it is uh, she is should I say so I think if pocket medicine doesn't come out with a boosted rate I will definitely go for the tooth fairy uh, because I really need a good healer and in this banner you are also gonna you can also get this character you know this one is one of the best support play support characters out there so while you're pulling for this you are also going to be able to get this one you know always some good stuff also real guide skins and other uh, stuff that you can uh, do with that also can join the team on discord or support them on coffee but yeah thank you guys for watching i just wanted to show you this wiki um you know some people might not know so it's gonna be in the description thank you guys watching. Peace.